Yes, uh, their relativism picks up an important truth and blows it right out of all proportion. That is, the Enlightenment world of rationality thought they could reduce all truth to absolute certainty and have come to the end of their time at the end of the 20th century understanding that you cannot, that humans are unable to know everything of an absolute certainty or be able to com communicate with each other with a 100% accuracy level because both the speaker and the hearer are unable to express themselves with absolute accuracy and fullness and because a lot of conversation is about social relationship rather than providing information. So between those two things, uh, it meant that post-modernity is not something that we Christians should run away from. It's a friend, actually, because it undermines modernity. But Christians are pre-moderns. We were never conned into believing that, Christ, that humans would know everything of an absolute certainty anyway. Uh, Romans 1 warned us against that. However, as a result of this atheistic swing from total absolute knowledge of the human brain through to relativism where we can't know anything, they've, they're throwing the baby out with the, with the bathwater. Uh, when you call out, which we're not going to, that this is a fire drill and you need to leave the building, it's not, so don't, we will be able to communicate to you fairly accurately of what is the nature of the danger and what to do and how to do there. And just when we call all this information out, someone won't start playing tennis down the front and another person start making a movie over in the corner. We know what we, we are able to communicate. And the fact that there is in the last few percent or the fact that running through the whole of language there is some degree of uncertainty does not undermine the power of us being created in the image of God because being created in the image of God means we can talk about God because we are like God and analogical language will work in the, dis in the discussion of God. And so post-modernity is yet another attempt of atheistic minds to run away from God. 